find the right spot, you know, a productive spot. There's a lot of fish there, and you're, you're throwing the crankbait, you're throwing the Alabama rig, the swim bait type stuff, and the fish quit biting. One of my favorite baits is this big uh, flutter spoon. You know, there's, there's several different sizes. You really can't go with the wrong size. You know, you have a smaller size, bigger, flashier ones. And what I like to do with this thing is, is throw it out there, you know, through the school, and you really just want to rip it and let the thing fall on a slack line. You're going to catch a lot of fish on these things, and some big ones too. Now I know guys, there's, you can run a stinger hook up here, but I usually just keep one just solid, you know, a nice thick treble hook down there, and you're going to catch a ton of fish on this. Another bait, kind of the same application as this big hair jig, and it's, a, it's the same kind of concept. You want, to, you want to throw it out there, you know, let it hit the bottom, maybe rip it up, and then let it kind of pendulum swing back through the water column. And, you know, again, these are, these are techniques here, these two baits that are going to catch fish when you already kind of beat up the school and you're just looking for one or two more keeper bites. And of course you can catch some really, really big ones on both of these.